Hey guys, this is the video where you are going to learn how to plot a line graph from the Excel data that you have. So here is my Excel data which contains months and which contains certain revenues earned for that month. Using this data, how can you plot a line graph? In this video, you have learned how to design a bar graph. This video is going to be an extension to the previous video where we have learned how to draw a bar graph. I am going to make only few changes to the line number 11 code. Now instead of a bar for a line graph, I will be using something called plot. So plot is a function for line graph. Just by doing this, if you run this particular code, you can see a pretty simple line graph has appeared. However, I need few modifications to be done. For example, for all these data points, I need a circle button at this particular data points. So how to get that? Let me close this graph and here I am going to enter few parameters. So one of the parameter for the marker is called marker. Okay. So marker is the parameter and how do you define? Let's say I would like to have some circle kind of a thing. Then you have to type O here. Let me run this particular code. You can see by doing that, I got this circle marks in this graph. What if I would like instead of sky blue, I would probably prefer a blue color. Let's see that. Now you can see it is appearing more clear and the circles are also looking better. Now what if instead of a straight line like this, I would like to put some dash, right? Some dash line. So how to get that? Let me close this. I am going to enter another parameter called line style equals to now for a dash line all you have to simply put the hyphen twice and then run the code now what you have seen here you can a dash line appearing in the entire graph what if instead of a circle i would like to have some square kind of icon here so how to do that for that simply marker i am going to change this o and replace it with s and let me run it now you can see instead of a circle you have got a kind of a square kind of a simple markers for each of the data points like this we can make multiple modifications by using the parameter values however for the basic need this should be good what i think however if you have any further questions please do comment in the sec comment section if this video was helpful for your requirement please do give a like to this video and do subscribe to our channel Thank you for watching this video. We are going to meet once again in our next content. Till then, take care.